Welcome to Kid Nation Extra, your Friday edition, where we work a little extra overtime just for you, Kid Nation. For you! Just in case you didn't get enough show, we give you just one little more, a little cherry on top. Online. Or pretzel. Yes. Is that what you're eating right now? I'm enjoying a bag of 100 calorie... Snyder's pretzels. Yeah, we do have uh, we have snacks back there. Yeah, we do. I just I'm realized so that. Oh, hungry! I'm starving today. I don't know why I didn't go get bacon today. I gotta go get bacon. <clears throat> now that you said it. Yeah. yeah. I forgot to get breakfast this morning. I hate when I do that. I'm intermittent fasting without wanting to. <laughs> <laughs> Unbeknownst to you. Unbeknownst to me. Right. Um, I realized yesterday. I don't think I'm doing my credit card. I didn't talk about this earlier. I don't think I'm credit carding right. What do you mean? Because I'm, I'm supposed to be building credit, right? I just got my first credit card this year. Yeah. And I buy something with my credit card, and then I get so scared that I get home, and I log on, and I pay it. Well, you can wait. Yeah. If you wait and pay, you can pay your credit card off every month and not get charged any interest. Yeah. You don't have to pay it the same day. Am I still getting my points and, yeah. my, and my credits going yeah, up? Yeah, points. Yeah. As long as, even if I'm paying it like two minutes after? Well, why would you do that? Just wait till the end of the month and pay know. it. I get scared. I don't know how to credit card. <laughs> What's going to happen is they're going to send you a bill. Yeah. And everything you charge that month is going to be on that bill. And if you pay it in its entirety, it's no interest. Uh huh. But if you make the minimum payment, which you can do that if you're a little $35? short of cash, yeah. you can just let the balance carry over. You will be charged interest at that point. It's financing uh, by There you go. Raspberry. I'm trying to help. He's I never know. had a credit card. Yeah, I'm just trying to. Home but you don't have to pay it that same day to save no. the interest. But I'm still getting my credit towards my credit? Yes. Okay. That's all I care about. My wife was wondering, too, because I don't think she'd ever had a credit card as well. Wow. Two yeah. of you. Mm-hmm. I think she had one with her family, but not her. her yeah. For herself. Hey, okay. I was when I was in college, I guess, when I got my first one, and I didn't understand it at the time either. Yeah. Right. I even was late with my very first payment. I just didn't think about it and sent an apology note with my payment. <laughs> Handwritten. <laughs> I figured that would, uh, yeah. you know, buy me a little... Maybe skip the, the late good fee. graces. No, they didn't. Though, yeah. did they? I don't remember. It's been so long, but sometimes yeah. they'll forgive it. Sometimes I hear. Sometimes, if you call and explain a situation, they'll be nice to you. Sometimes it just depends. Yeah, see, this whole time I just didn't think I was doing the. I, I thought I wasn't getting my credit built up because I was paying it too fast. That's what my wife said. Hmm. But glad to hear it's not the case. Not I don't the know. Case, I've heard sir. that it does affect you if you carry a balance. That sometimes they say carrying a balance is a good thing. I will. I will say this. They say never close an account. Always keep it open. You can pay it off, but don't close it. Well, I've, I've heard that, you know, when you're going to buy a house, they'll wow. say you have too much available credit. That can hurt you. Really? So you should, clo- yes, you should close some accounts. Whoa. I guess it depends on who you ask. Yeah. I guess so. I was thinking about opening up uh, an American Airlines one because I was flying and they were like, hey, you should open it. You get 50,000 miles. Oh, okay. Well, you know. But Alan, you got to pay a yearly Alan fee. Alan does a lot of research on credit cards. If you want to ask him okay. which one you should get. Hello, I'm Alan. Because we he gets uh, he we use so many points that he forgives a lot of our travel. Mm. Oh, uh, that's what I need to do. Hello, I'm Alan. Another thing I learned when I was coming up because every time you go into a store at the mall, they'd say, "Would you like to open a credit card and save ten percent?" Why, yes, I would. So I had like thirty credit cards because you just go in and I never use yeah. them anymore, and that ends up hurting you too. Because you had too much had available too much credit. Available credit. Mm. Look at me learning credit stuff right yeah, now. Yeah, look at that. At this ripe age. Mm-hmm. Probably should have learned that way back in the day. Doesn't, oh. doesn't, hey, never too old to learn. Look, I, never too old to learn. I grew up poor, so I thought, why become more poor by yeah. getting in the hole? So that's why I never got a credit card. Now, hey, you know what? There's a certain amount of logic to that. Yeah. Al, you're going out to San Antonio this weekend for a do-over? Do-over prom. Yeah, it's, a, it's an adult-only prom. No kids at this one. They will have alcohol treats, from what I hear. Yeah. And it's in San Antonio, Texas, from the new 96 one now. They're going to legally spike the punch. Yeah, yeah well, you can actually but, drink. And apparently, from what you guys were telling me earlier, they're opening this up. It doesn't have to be a couple. You know, you can just bring a girlfriend. So if you're in the San Antonio area, hey, I'll let you yeah. boy. And the hook the hooking up is cool because now you're you're for reals adults with jobs and stuff. Right. It's in a hotel. And it's in a hotel, so there's the rooms are right there. <laughs> and you're staying there? Yeah. What room? I, I think. I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm staying there or at another hotel. I haven't You no should one, just give out your room number. No one sent that. I may. He doesn't know it yet. Yeah. yeah. I might. You taking off today? Uh no, I leave tomorrow morning. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'll be in San Antonio all day Sunday and part of I'm sorry, all day Saturday and part of Sunday. Oh, so you're going to stay a little extra day? I'm staying over, you know, just what? in case I find me a 
prom queen? You've had some luck with girls in San Antonio, I'd say. Zero. Oh. <laughs> Zero luck in San Antonio. Yeah, say wrong. Yeah. Yeah. I love San Antonio. Yeah. I do. I do. We stayed at the Hotel Valencia yeah. in San Antonio. Uh -huh. In the and past, yeah. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. But, um, well, I didn't know if there was... See, Al gets excited Al's sometimes. like, that's to say that way. I didn't know if I was supposed to say There's so many things we're supposed to say and not supposed to say. I'm like, I almost called 911 right there. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I always forget. I'm like, well, okay, anyway. He's twitching over there. All right, I'm going to just shut up. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to eat another pretzel. Uh, yeah, that's you? what you do. How about we do the question of the day? How about we do all that? All right, all right. Amanda Briseño wrote us and said, if you got stuck in an elevator with two other people... Yeah. Who would you want to be with? One from the show and someone else. Who would it be? Kelly. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I think JC would help lighten the moment. Mm -hmm. And not that I don't love you desperately, Al, but I think JC would probably have a lot of positive vibes and you know little that little boy charm you oh, have that's positivity right. i would keep it i would keep that would positive you keep it probably light so i'd probably choose you from the show and i would maybe and i would even, have to choose my husband i mean alan? is that too oh. no that'd be fun you and alan would y'all would probably exclude me y'all have a little love affair going on yeah I'd just be sitting huh. there watching you two we could bro out alan could probably hoist me up and, and help me get out right. so that i can get us out of the elevator why wouldn't right. y'all hoist me up because you wouldn't want to get hurt up there with all That's the mechanical it stuff. It's not that you can't hoist. Me. No, no. Because in that way, I could climb up the chute and I go need get some help. Pretzel while I think about that. <laughs> I admit, I have put on a little weight. Uh, that's not what I was talking about. But you know what? I'm in such a comfortable place in my life. I'm like, I don't care. I care a little bit because I have a lot of really cute things I bought when I lost weight for the wedding. I yeah. thought, oh, I'm never gaining this weight back. Can't wear it. Don't tell yourself that. As long as you feel happy, that's all that matters. I'm completely happy. I just, you know, I wish I looked better. Yeah. But I like, who cares? <laughs> Big Al, who would you want to be stuck in the elevator with? Two not, people. Not Kelly. Oh, dang. Um, See, now they told me I had to pick one. I said I love you had desperately. To pick one. Anyway, I guess, um, let's see. You pick JC, too. You know uh, you would. I'd probably pick Jenna. And uh, because since y'all have, have y'all little thing going on with you and JC Why? and Alan, what do, what do I what? Jenna can probably box her way out of the elevator. Just uh. start boom, 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 boom. You, know what? you boom. can't handle that. Yeah, 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 yeah. She could probably box her way out. And as far as a non-show member, um, Fat Whitey, my my friend, your Fat buddy, Whitey. yeah, my buddy, Fat Whitey, and that's his nickname. It's not Al doesn't call him that. That's what he goes I, by. He put his name and number in my phone years ago, and he put it as Fat Whitey. So um, because he's just so funny, and uh, he would keep me laughing while I was in the elevator. Okay. Yeah. What about you, dog? Um, if I had Al in the elevator, I'd be too scared of the. Because you get nervous. See? What are you talking about? <laughs> I feel like <laughs> we all have. Yeah, you're talking about your pee stain today. Like you're obviously not holding back anything. So I don't know if I would want that We're sort all of being very passive aggressive. Sort, right sort of action. That's not passive aggressive. That's blatant. <laughs> I feel like Jenna would. Oh, so you gonna pick Kelly? I feel like, yeah, I feel like Jenna would just. What good? She would be is, really down on on her luck. What good is Kelly Raspberry gonna do on a stuck elevator? I feel I mean, like Kelly. What do you mean? Like, I mean, well, I'm just asking, why? What's your rationale for that? I feel like Kelly would just be trying to come up with a, she'd be coming up with a plan on how to get out, and she's always prepared, so she'd probably have snacks in her purse. Thank you. So I'd probably pick Kelly for that. Thank you. What kind of snacks do you have in your purse? She right had now? Some pretzels today. Right now, I probably have a protein bar. See? Let me see. And what do I love, Al? Protein. I want to see what I have in my purse. Sure. I have another purse inside you my purse. You have a purse, purse. Oh, inside I have your a purse. purse inside my purse because sometimes my big purse is too big, and I just want to carry a little purse. She has another my, person or purse. So my yeah. little purse, I have a lot of breath mints, which See? would be good. In That's close snack, quarters, yes. A ton of them. Of course. Pins. I have about four or five different lip glosses. And I have this cute little, we went to a vodka tasting the other night for Grey Goose. And look at this cute little stirrer that what looks like that? a goose. It's I forgot a to take it out of my oh, yeah. thing. Just and I have all cocktail. my credit cards and my money in there. Which we could use for tools. And I have one makeup case <laughs> uh -huh. that has lots mm. of lip glosses, allergy eye drops, lots of uh, pressed powder, and lipsticks. That's in one makeup case. Then I have another Good makeup Lord. case. I always have to be prepared with uh, sunscreen, allergy pills, a nail file, more eye drops, more lipstick, 
Uh, this is Advil cold and sinus, which I have recommended what if I have a cold? to so many people. Yep. Um, so that's in that makeup case. Mm-hmm. This is kind of interesting. I need. Yeah, to I didn't. Her. Wow. I have an eyeglass case, which care, which also you has my eyeglass, cl- my sunglasses. Oh, okay. Which has my uh, clean, my little cleaning call. And just in case you didn't know what bag that was, it has I have the eyes on it. Eyeglass case because you can never apparently have enough. <laughs> I have a notebook because I love to write things down. What would you write down yesterday? List. This is my to-do list that I've been crossing off. I had to write some thank you notes. I had to blog something. I had to go to Costco. Mm-hmm. Change of address notes. I had to notify my doctor's office of my new address. I had to get a... De- oh, I have to do this. These are some things I haven't done yet. I, have to get, I had to get EK covered. My daughter covered because we're going on a family vacation. Mm-hmm. Go by the dry cleaners. Just, just errands like that. Okay. Protein bar, Protein so I did bar. have a snack. Protein bar number two. See, we'd have food, Al. <laughs> okay. Protein bar number three. Jeez. All right, I'll change my mind. I told you. Sorry, Jenna. Kelly's Kelly. the best Protein one to go with. Protein bar number four. <laughs> Sorry, Jenna, I'm going with Kelly. <laughs> Protein bar number five. Jeez. We'd, we'd live for days in there. Breath mint. Protein bar number six. Earbuds. Loose change oh pins. Oh, my gosh. Bed, bath, and beyond coupons. Oh, you can do a little couponing while you're Tissue in the Tissue for when we're crying because we're never going to be rescued. Right. <laughs> Business cards. That's about it. Oh, See, keys to cars. So, obviously, my theory of having Kelly would be correct because she'd be yeah. extremely prepared to last for at least a week in there with those protein bars. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And the other person I would choose is my wife. Just when I got bored, somebody I could make out with. Yeah. And then she could talk with Kelly when I wanted to play Fortnite on my phone yeah. while we wait for the firefighters. Because in my backpack, I wouldn't be prepared at all. I have nothing. Yeah. Nothing except a couple pictures that my kids drew me. Oh, that's sweet. That's a heart uh, Chloe drew me. Her hearts look like molars. Aw. Yeah, she doesn't have the thing down yet. She'll get that's it. Right. With a lot of happy faces. And then uh, my dad. Oh, that's a birthday card my, dad, my son gave me. She did the three. He did the three backwards. Yeah. It's an E5, but... Aww. And it's happy. He doesn't like vowels because he, he doesn't sound them out. So it's happy birthed. <laughs> <laughs> happy birthed da, Papa. Oh, there's a Y. Birthday. So that's all I have in my backpack. So obviously. No backpack over here. That's why I would take Kelly over I'm going, you. I'm going commando on the backpack. And my wife to make out with. While Kelly stands in the corner watching. Oh, well, very so interesting question. <laughs> Oh, very interesting question right yeah. there. Let's choose for Jenna. Who would Jenna want in the elevator with her? Harry uh, Styles. Harry Styles and would be prob- the guy. Probably, and she'd pick you. Probably me. Oh, you don't think she'd pick the guy that she went to the hockey game with? Well, he's not part of the show. Well, neither is Harry Styles. We had to pick one member of the show and somebody that's not. Okay, right. I'm saying Remember, like, Fat substitute. Whitey's not part of the show? Substitute for Harry Styles is what I'm saying. Oh. No, I think she'd pick Harry Styles. No, she'd probably pick Harry Styles. Uh, okay. Because she already had the guy. <laughs> <laughs> We, we are assuming. Assuming. Well, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Clink, clink in the bowl. Yeah. yeah. All right, Kid Nation. We'll be back next week. Another shot for you to win up to $1,000 twice a day with Beat the Bank every single day next week. And we're going to talk to Megan Trainer. Yeah. She's cool. She's uh, the, the four is finally back. She got an album out. She got an album out. So we'll chat with her. Anything else I'm missing? I think that's it. I think that's it. We got we got other stuff too. I just don't have it in front of me. The normal stuff. You know the, the bank. The good stuff. Big, yeah. Beat the bank and love letters and uh, all stuff. that good stuff. Maybe we'll other do some stuff. petty Monday. Yeah, that's we'll probably do fun. some petty Monday. We'll get into that. You have a wonderful weekend. Be safe and be uh be back here on Monday. We'll see you then. See y'all.